I always thought I was very different from the people around me when I went to high school. I ate different food, I spoke a different language at home, and in a lot of ways I think that's what Aladdin feels. <laughs> You're playing quite an iconic role. So how is it to fill the shoes of a character that everybody already knows and loves, especially? Yeah, it's, you know, it's, um, I think it's every actor's dream to get that opportunity. And um, what was important for me was that I just wanted to make it my own. Uh, I wanted to make the character as human and as real as possible. But uh, one of the things I did actually was the first time that I got a call back, audition for it, I decided I wasn't going to watch the animation anymore. So I stopped watching the animation and uh, I just wanted to focus on the, the underlying messages in the film and, and the journey that the character goes on. You stumbled upon an opportunity. I can make you rich. Rich enough to impress a princess. What would I have to do? There's a cave of wonders. Bring me the lamp. Um, we were talking about Marwan earlier, Marwan yes. Kanzari. He's from the Netherlands, so he's quite a big star in Holland. So yes. how is it for you to play with him? Uh, Marwan's amazing. He's one of my favorite people in the world. He's incredibly well-read. Uh, he's incredibly educated and um, he's just very generous. You know, he was like uh, a big brother to me. You look like a prince on the outside, but I didn't change anything on the inside. Showtime. No, I'm in charge, okay? I say when it's time. What is it that you put into your Aladdin? Yeah, you know, I was born in Egypt. Uh, my parents immigrated to Canada when I was very young and um, I grew up as an immigrant. So I always thought I was very different from the people around me when I went to high school. I ate different food, I spoke a different language at home. And in a lot of ways, I think that's what Aladdin feels throughout the film, that he can't identify with people, that he's different, he can't relate to them. He has these like thoughts of, is he good enough? And I felt all those things growing up in a very real way. So I just wanted to, to touch on those things and, and bring those to the screen. So I think in that way, I, I related to him a lot. Mm -hmm. a whole new world. Don't you dare close your eyes. 